Hello! Hi, this is a very windy day in the desert. I hope you can hear us. This is Debbie. Hi. <laughs> and she has an amazing vehicle. Let me show you. So Debbie, this is a Mercedes Metris. I love the color. Thank you. Yeah, I, I fell in love with it, the color of it. It's and it's like, good in the, in the summertime when it's hot. You know, it's not a dark color. So it ah, doesn't the sun. Interesting. So yeah, Metris. I, I had never heard of that before, but it's okay. I'm not too much into cars, yeah. you know, like guys are. Hi guys! <laughs> <laughs> so, and you were telling me that that, uh, where is my finger here? Um, that thing over here is the fan. The Max Air fan, yep. Nice. And you have a Thule box. Mm -hmm. And you do have another chest or what do you call it? Well, it's a, just a cargo carrier. There you go. Yeah. And you have, what did you say you have in there? Um, I have basically my two chairs. I have a shower tent. I have a cover, a reflective cover that I can put over my van if I want to, um, if I'm in the hot sun, it yep. reflects it. It works really good. And um, that and my, uh, my um, what do you call those bottles of uh, fuel? <laughs> uh, propane? Propane. Yeah. Yeah, I have an insulated bag in there. Nice. Yeah. Very nice. So uh, I told you already, I love the color of your van. It's uh, it's beautiful. The first impression is it is slightly bigger than my minivan. Mm -hmm. But then I took a peek inside and it gets really interesting. Well, so you want to come in and see it? Please. All right, let's go. We can go. Right so, thank you for showing us your home, Debbie. Oh, welcome, welcome. I love the fact that you have the the layout allows you to have the bed from side to side mm -hmm. with a lot of room on top of your bed mm -hmm. and you say i think it is a little wider than a twin yes the it's twin definitely mattress. a little wider it's very nice so it fits I, me perfectly and i'm only five three on a good day <laughs> so i i can stretch out and i'm sometimes my feet touch the wall but that's okay I right with me, but I don't usually sleep straight out. I usually sleep, you know, in a sideways or kind something. of a fetal position. Yeah. And you were saying that that bed was made by a friend of yours? Yes. Um, a friend of mine made it. He had some scrap lumber. Uh -huh. So he constructed the whole thing for me. And, um, and you do have fiber under the yes, mattress, that right? that helps with uh, keeping the moisture. That down. is so important. Right. Yes, people have fiber or something, so air circulates right. underneath the mattress. That is excellent. So right. tell us a little bit about your bedroom. All of those things. Oh, what, up here? You mean? Yeah, and in back. I mean that bar. And oh, I've got hanging that for hanging clothes, and I also have. Well, I have a fan hanging there, and back here. Um, my doors won't open all the way. I used to have a swing away hitch, but it broke. But I have my, I put my solar panels there because I have a suitcase solar. Okay. I don't have it on the top. And my solar panels go back there and they fit perfectly. And let's see, what else? I have a lot of pillows because I like sleeping with a lot of pillows. Nice. And um, I do have a, this thing when I travel, this is a cushion and I'll put it up here. This goes in my front seat to sit on. Good. Yes, the cushion, I put it on top of my uh, toilet. This is oh, a porta that is potty. your toilet. Yeah, it's a porta potty, and I have it in a case. Ah. So if I want to move it, all I have to do, because for me it's not that heavy, is just slide it. Yep. Like that, if I need to get into my storage underneath the bed. Perfect. So. You have a lot of storage yep. there. Yep. Amazing. I can't believe. This is slightly bigger than my van. That is, this is amazing. And over here, I have all my kitchen stuff. Well, my toilet paper, but <laughs> um, that goes 
away when I'm driving, but I have all my kitchen stuff in here, some food in there, and uh, yeah. And you do have a microwave. Yep. So what, what do you use for electric? I have between, I have three Jackeries. Okay. This one here is 2,000 watts. Wow. 2,000. Yeah. I have my uh, refrigerator over here, which is hooked up to 1,000 watts. Wow. And then I have a 300, which I use just to charge my... The phone. The phone and stuff. Yeah. Wow. You're very well prepared indeed. So... I probably have too much uh, solar? solar, but it's better to have more... Of course. ...than less. Of course. It's, and how many panels do you have? I have two 200 watt panels and a 100 watt panel. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. So, if it is, well, lately we have been having a lot of rainy days and cloudy days, but if it is nice and sunny, you're good. Yes. Excellent. And I can charge them, I can charge them three ways. I can charge them by my solar panels, I can charge them by my car when my car is running, or yeah. I, if I'm at a campsite, I can charge them there. Yeah. Or anywhere there's a plug. Of course. Yeah. Of course. I, I love what you have there over the, I mean, you have a little counter and you have all these cute things. <laughs> you have well, I painted have to, rock. Have, did you see this? I have, this I cannot take down because my five-year-old granddaughter made it for me. Oh, baby. Yeah. So I have to keep what it What is there. her she, name? Her name is Talitha. Talitha, yeah. look at look at grandma. She's displaying that. And Very she, proud. She hung it up for me with her band-aids. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. So I have and you have a little uh, shelf there. Yep. With some books some, and my books are up here and yeah. my toilet items, you know, the uh, grooming items. Yeah. Right there. And uh, I have a five-gallon water jug here. And. Um, all these little things, like my grandson gave me that, pictures of my kids, pictures of my other, that's my son out in California, and uh, I have to get an updated picture of that because they just had a baby, Aww. so four of them now. It's beautiful. Um, these are my, this is where my clothes are. Let me take a look at that. So it's a, it's a plastic chest. Yes, and it's very lightweight. Now I had originally... Beautiful. Originally, I had the, from Walmart, I had a chest, but it kind of fell apart. Mine, mine did. Yeah. Yeah. But I got this at, um, when I was at my brother's back east. So it's a Sterilite. Yeah. But I am in love with your van. And Thank what do you, you have there? A fridge? This is my refrigerator. It's a um, Bouge RV fridge, um, 58 quart. What is the name again? Bouge RV. Oh, okay. Right no, it's okay. Don't worry. You sure? Yeah. I mean... I can show the inside if you want to see it. Wow. It's a big baby. Wow. Yep. So And good. it can be a fridge or freezer, but I use it as a fridge. Beautiful. So. Yeah. I will put a link to the... Uh, to the fridge itself. To the... So, if people are interested in such a nice it's, big i've had it for over a year now and I, it's beautiful the only thing i bought this uh cover yep insulated cover and it ripped but i wrote the company and they sent they sent me a new one nice i have to go pick it up when i get to texas but nice. yes yeah. so very good customer service excellent and i have a curing coffee maker um that i use when I'm uh, hooked up to a campsite, I don't bother with it. I, I mean, I could use my 2000 Jackery for, for yes. it, but I like pour over coffee. Yes. It tastes so much better. I am lazy. I am doing uh, instant coffee. Yeah. <laughs> and you have a beautiful cabin. I mean, the van has a beautiful cabin. And I see here you have a rail. Is that for your curtains? Oh, the rail? Yeah. Yes. Now I can bring my curtains all the way around. So if I don't want to close yeah. my whole van up, I can bring the curtains all the way around to have privacy. So they close from here, from this door, from right here, all the front. All the way to there. Yeah. 
I can't believe the van is that little outside and you have this beautiful home inside. Thank you so Amazing. much. Amazing. I love it. It's good for me. I know. And are you a full-time nomad? Yes. Okay. How long ago? Uh, it's been a, it, just about a year now. Yeah. Nice. Year. Yep. Very nice. But you lived in Texas. Mm -hmm. So, and now you're here in Courtside for the RTR. My first RTR. Yay! How and did I've you been like a it? subscriber of yours for quite a while and I, <laughs> it was so wonderful to meet you. It was wonderful meeting you. You're Amazing. better in person than on the... <laughs> of course, of course. <laughs> so, but how did you like the RTR? It was pretty good. I mean, I liked it. Uh, especially today about jobs because I'm all about getting a job so nice and got to talk to you know people about that yeah. so and tomorrow we are going to go to the big tent right for eight I gotta get up I gotta be there for eight o'clock <sighs> yeah and it's gonna be so cold cold and windy yeah do we really have to go that early <sighs> you said eight o'clock I, I know I know because we want to be there when they just open right. for the best opportunities. Parking. Yeah. Yes. Why? But, Why? <laughs> yeah. But just, you know, just being out here and meeting everybody has yeah. been so wonderful. Great group. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely Amazing. a great group. Yep. A lot of laughs and good campfire yep. stories that last night was great. I know. I mean, it, it is part of what we need because if you're on your own, uh, just camping out there, it can get a little too boring. Yeah. But I love socializing here right. in Courtside. Everybody approaches everybody. Right. And connections are made. Yes. Beautiful. And I've made quite a few connections, and I'm nice. absolutely thrilled. Excellent. And my son, I, my older son, he said to me, "Mom, I'm so happy for you. <laughs> he nice. says you're meeting so many people. He says this is what you wanted." I said, "You're right." That is lovely. <laughs> Thank you so much, Debbie, for showing us your home. Um, people will write comments. If they have questions, you're more than welcome to correspond directly with them. Sure. And uh, thank you. This is beautiful. Well, thanks for letting me show it. Are you sure you don't want to trade? <laughs> well, I haven't seen yours. I mean, except for on the videos. <laughs> it's a teeny little thing. <laughs> So thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, thank you. Andriana, thank Have you. Have a great day. Take Thanks, care. Thanks everybody. Let me feel your love again. Cause I've been running round in circles screaming out your name. Take me to a different place. Just the two of us and we can stay up all night. Kissing under street lights.